So guys, for the first step, once you're on Steam, you wanna click on Steam in the top left, and now you wanna click on Settings. And now once you're on this, you wanna go to the Controller tab, and now once you're on this, you want to scroll down, and you want to enable Steam input for your controller. For me, I'm using an Xbox controller, so I enabled it for Xbox controllers, so you wanna enable it. If you're using a Switch controller, you wanna enable it. Generic controller, you wanna enable it. And you can also enable it for your PlayStation controller. We can now close out of this. And now you want to go to Bully. And now on the right hand side, you want to select View Controller Settings. You want to select Enable Steam Input. Make sure that you have Steam Input enabled. We can now close out of this. Now, for some reason, if you could not see this on the right hand side where it says Controller and View Controller Settings, then you just want to restart Steam. To do that, in the bottom right of your taskbar, you want to click on the arrow. You want to find Steam, right click on it, and then click on Exit Steam. Now you can open it back up again and you should now be seeing these settings right here. So you want to enable Steam Input for your controller. For the next step, we're going to launch Bully. And now once we're here, you want to click on Escape on your keyboard. Now we're going to scroll down to Controls, click on Enter. You're going to be seeing Xbox 360 compatible on the top. Now here is where the problem occurs because sometimes you can't actually select it. So once you're on the controls, now you want to go back again. So you want to go back, click on the spacebar to go back. And now you want to open up controls again. So you want to click on left alt to open up controls. And now you want to click on the right arrow on your keyboard, which should now take you to Xbox 360 compatible. You can try that a few times because sometimes it will bug out, but you want to go to Xbox 360 compatible. Click on the right arrow key on your keyboard. And now once we're here, you want to scroll down one time. You want to be on enable Xbox 360 compatible controls and then use the arrow key to enable it. And then click on left alt again. And that's how you do it. It's now been enabled. I'm now using my controller.